Amy and Tammy Slayton might not find love again if their relationships are indeed over on 1000 LB Sisters. Neither of the sisters has been lucky in love, and unfortunately, their future may not be any different from their past. While they have had completely different experiences when it comes to dating, it hasn't changed the similar outcome they are both headed towards. Amy and Tammy have had ups and downs in their relationships, personally and romantically, and they could be part of the problem. While it's true the sisters handle difficult situations and challenges differently, they do share a lot in common based on who they are as people and how they were raised. Amy's marriage to Michael Halterman is headed for divorce, and rumors have emerged that Tammy's relationship with Caleb Willingham may be in the middle of a similar predicament. 5 1000 LB Sisters Tammy Slayton's attitude could be a problem Tammy's attitude has been an issue on 1000 LB Sisters throughout the seasons. She often disrespects her family and the people closest to her when she's upset and frustrated. Most likely, this part of her personality doesn't change when she's in a romantic relationship. Tammy has frequently put her love life ahead of her health, with disastrous consequences leading to her being even more angry and irritated. While Tammy's hot-tempered, her husband, Caleb, seems to be the complete opposite, which so far has had an impact on how she reacts and treats everyone around her. She has credited him for helping her turn her life around, and if their marriage comes to an end, as alleged rumors continue to surface, the emotional progress she has made could go out the window. Tammy's attitude is a lot to handle, even for her family, and the probability of her finding another relationship that will put up with her mean-spirited comments and attitude is slim. For 1000 LB sisters Amy Slayton's inability to appreciate her partner Amy and Michael have been together for years, and all seem to be well in their relationship. The couple was thrilled to tie the knot and expand their family with their sons, Gage and Glenn Halterman. Since becoming parents, they have struggled to get on the same page, with Amy often pointing the finger at Michael for all his shortcomings. However, she has failed to see all the things he has done in their relationship and that she has made mistakes along the way too. Aside from 1000 LB sisters, Amy doesn't have another job and relies on Michael to have employment outside the home. He not only has had a reliable and steady job, but he has contributed to their marriage in many other ways besides financially that Amy may not see. Michael has helped with Tammy's care and transportation throughout the years as well as doing anything Amy needs when she asks, whether it's going to the grocery, tending to her pregnancy cravings, or doing his part around the house. 3. Amy Tammy Slayton's Immaturity on 1000 LB Sisters Although both sisters are known for their hilarious and unique sense of humor and banter on 1000 LB Sisters, their level of immaturity can be quite astounding. Amy and Tammy often mispronounce words, which is a reflection of their knowledge and education, and although it's funny, their immature behavior can be a turn-off. They also use humor to mask their true feelings, and that could quickly become a problem in a relationship instead of facing it head-on. If it's the end of their marriages to Caleb and Michael, Amy and Tammy may have a difficult time finding a romantic relationship that will take them seriously. Especially now that Amy has children, she needs to find a stable and reliable relationship if she ever goes looking for love again. If Tammy is headed towards a divorce, it will be important for her to also find someone that she can count on, especially as she continues her journey toward a healthier lifestyle. 
Two Amy Tammy's lack of independence on 1000 LB Sisters Another problem that both Amy and Tammy could run into in future relationships is their lack of independence. Although the sisters desire to do things on their own without the help of anyone around them, neither of them is fully independent. Throughout the seasons of 1000 LB Sisters, Amy and Tammy have not only relied on each other but also on everyone else around them. Neither of them has jobs outside the home, and they aren't able to transport themselves without Michael or their other siblings. While the sisters have come a long way on their weight loss journeys, their weight is still holding them back from doing even more. To find true love, both Amy and Tammy need to reflect on themselves first and work on themselves physically and mentally. They both struggle with self-esteem and confidence issues, which will hinder their ability to find someone that will care for them later on down the road. Their codependency toward one another will also put a damper on any future romantic relationships and their ability to find someone. 1. Amy Tammy Sladen's standards are low on 1000 LB Sisters Tammy, in particular, has a checkered past full of red flags when it comes to her romantic relationships. Even though she has always wanted someone who loves her for who she is, she tends to look for love in all the wrong places. Before meeting Caleb at the rehab facility, all of her previous boyfriends she had met online and weren't in the relationship for the right reasons. Unfortunately, her health, as well as her weight, was not a top priority, and they ultimately had a bad influence on her, but despite everything, it didn't deter her from continuing with the relationships. Even though Amy hasn't had nearly as much drama when it comes to her dating life, she struggles with her self-image and self-worth too, which plays a role in the men she does attract. Michael has been a hard-working provider for the family, but he most likely wasn't her first choice, and she was already familiar with him since they had known each other since childhood. If Amy and Tammy don't expect more from themselves on 1000 LB Sisters, they will have a difficult time finding the lasting relationship they so desperately want.